So yeah, definitely not the prettiest example of a C4 Corvette that you've ever seen. But definitely serviceable and she runs great. I mean, look at her. I mean, equal parts midlife crisis, equal parts I love the 80s. I mean, who can say no to that? Greetings one and all, it is I, the family car guy. I am here today in lovely uh, Golden Valley, Minnesota. That's where I hail from. And I wanted to just introduce you guys to my channel. Uh, my name is David. I reside in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Uh, I am the family car guy. Why am I the family car guy? Well, when I think about YouTube videos and I think about all the car videos that are out there, uh, you got people like Street Speed 717 who I really like his videos, uh, all kinds of Corvette stuff. He's a Corvette guy and then he's also got the, the nice uh, diesel truck. Uh, you got people like uh, Jimbo out there with the C4, which I'm going to introduce you to my car in just a second. Uh, but you have people that are, you know, maybe the mid-20s, early 20s, late 20s, whatever the case may be, uh, and they've got, you know, nice cars. How can I afford such a nice car at such a young age, whatever the case may be. And that's and that's amazing, you know, absolutely. Please go ahead and make videos like that. And I've, I've been thoroughly entertained and enjoyed the content. But myself, I'm, I'm in my early 30s. Uh, I've, I'm married, I've got three kids. Um, and I happen to have a passion for uh, exciting sports cars, just like a lot of these other guys that are out there. Uh, but I don't necessarily, I can't necessarily relate to uh, all of the the content that I see out there that that describes people of that age group and that kind of demographic So I figured hey, how about I make a channel that talks about how do you maintain and how do you how do you? Celebrate and, and how do you explore a passion for cars and still balance the needs of, of your family? You know, I've got three kids my oldest happens to have just turned uh, four or will be turning four I should say in a few weeks uh, and then my next youngest just turned three and then my youngest uh, he's two months. So how do you have a passion for cars? And what do you, how do you even, how do you even, what does that even look like when you're me? You've got a family, you've got responsibilities, you know, you've got a wife, you know, you're trying to keep the wife happy. You're trying to, you know, spend time with your kids, but you're still really excited about your passion for cars. So that's what this channel is really going to explore. And hopefully we're going to have a lot of fun doing it. We're going to do a lot of different videos talking about, you know, what, what do I own right now? What am I driving? What am I interested in? And obviously I want to see what you guys are interested in as well. And we're just going to make this just kind of a fun channel, something that, you know, hopefully people in my, you know, my age group or my situation where, hey, you know, I have kids, I have young kids. How am I able to, you know, maintain a passion for cars? How am I able to keep the sports car in the house when I got, when I need, I know I need a minivan because I got a whole crew of kids. I mean, what does that look like? You know, what, can we still be in with the in crowd, so to speak, even though we don't necessarily fit all the same criteria that some of the other guys out there uh, that have a, a passion for cars and, and show that passion for cars on their channels, uh, what can we do? How can we relate? So this channel is for you guys and still obviously for the young guys that are out there too. Hopefully you're not discouraged that uh, if you do end up getting married and, and you have a wow that was a uh, yellow Lamborghini Huracan that went by. That was awesome. But anyway, um, you know, that hopefully you're not discouraged that hey your, your, your love and your passion for cars and your, and your car catalog is going away right as soon as you get married and you, and you have a couple of kids. Hopefully you're not discouraged by that. Hopefully I can give you some encouragement. Uh, that you can still make it all work and everyone can still be happy um, So that's that and I'm you know, I'm not a super rich guy or anything like that yet Hopefully I will be but the idea is you know can the everyday average Joe can he can he still maintain his passion for cars without sacrificing? You know his relationships with his family and that so to speak so that's the whole idea behind the family car guy I hope you're gonna enjoy the content uh, and from there we're gonna have a good time so uh, thanks for watching uh, please like and subscribe and we're gonna have a great time. Thanks again.